would happen if acid rain were to hit a plane? You guys are about to find out. How do I turn the people into popcorn? Oi, where did you guys come from? Three, two, one. <laughs> that is so cool. <laughs> How's it going champs? We're playing Teardown. I've got a handful of really fun looking mobs to check out today. There's this squid here. I, I don't understand who put this squid here, how he got here, what his name is. It's probably something like Steven. Let's put him back where he belongs. Inside this hotel, obviously. It's probably their squid. Let's just- Whoa! Whoa! You can surf on him! Okay, hang on. Don't surf on the squid. I'm still surfing on the squid. <laughs> put him just in the garden bed here, alright? I'm just gonna try and recreate his natural habitat of inside a garden bed. There we go, Steven. So this map is called Morvex Town. I don't know if that's in reference to anything. There's a lady, she's a rag doll. Okay, she doesn't like her job very much. She's just gonna lie on the floor and take a little bit of a nap. That's fine. It reminds me of that Asian-inspired map. The map was literally called that. That's not me being racist. I'm just gonna toss this guy around. This guy is also a rag doll. Okay, that... Um, he's an explosive man? So this wall just decided to explode on its own. I don't know what that's about. So one of the maps that we're taking a look at today is a super special map. It's made by K. Sabby, the guy who made Poopy Tim, who we all know and love. I'm just gonna cut this bus. This is also a very cool mod. This is a laser blaster made by Battle Bob, and it's like, it's all rainbowy. It's super cool. Oh, does this car work? Oh, yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. It's even got neons under it. That's how you know it's special. What was it that it exploded? Was it this? I think it might have been that. It's a fire hydrant. This person's probably a YouTuber or something. Weren't you outside a minute ago, champ? You've been spending too much time on the computer. I'm gonna grab this guy by the face. And we're just gonna take him outside. There you go. Go be one with nature. <laughs> There's a skeleton! Why? Hey, Ben. How's it going? How's it going, champ? Oh, I can't make him talk very well. Oh! Of course, it's Spooktober! Oh, what's in here? What's in this garage? Disappointment! Okay. Got a mod here that allows you to turn things into popcorn. How do I turn the people into popcorn? Oi, where did you guys come from? They just fell through the actual floor? <laughs> Ow! Are you serious? I get it, I get it. It turned everything into popcorn. Like, everything is popping around the place. That's kind of cool, except I keep getting slapped in the face with debris. I mean, popcorn's delicious and everything, but this is- it's, it's too much. Stop popping everywhere! Oh, the squid! Even the squid's moving on his own. Oh, look how flashy this gun is! And then you've got a mode that fires an even thicker beam? That's awesome! Except I'm still being slapped with debris in the face. Stop it! Indestructible squid. Oh, what? Both firing modes at once does even bigger. Find shelter. You have 15 seconds. Okay. Hang on. Maybe I could just hide under the stairs here. This looks like the best place. Harry Potter town right here. You guys might be wondering, hey, Finn, why do you need to seek shelter? Because of acid rain. Look at that stuff. Oh, dude. Yes. It's actually melting the ground. Russell. Is that his name? Did I call him Russell? I can't remember what I call him. Come inside, champ. There's acid rain. It's burning your fragile skin. Physics gun. Oh, yeah. Oh, that'll get him in here. Come on, champ. Protect yourself from the acid rain. Yeah, cover your eyes. There we go. Lady, you might want to get under the desk. That's it. Just crumple yourself. I am a briefcase. Just keep saying that over and over again. Oh, God. The acid rain's starting to eat through the ceiling. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I will protect all the people. Okay, quick. Get under here. Oh, briefcase lady. Get out of the way. <laughs> I need some more space. It's melting her skin! I feel like I'm being attacked by the Matrix. I managed to survive two minutes. That's not bad. So what would happen if acid rain were to hit a plane? You guys are about to find out. Are you super excited? This guy does not seem excited about the forecast of acid rain. The pilots are like, oh champs, we're about ready to get smashed with some acidic mountain dew stuff. <laughs> Something exploded. Something exploded over here. Ah! It's decompressing! Okay, okay. Everyone's gonna be fine. Just don't get sucked out of the plane and you'll be okay. No! The acid rain! I'm still in the plane! I'm just gonna hide down here. I'm gonna hide down here. I'm gonna- Oh god, look at the rain! Hey, there's water down there now! What? No! No! I got sucked from the plane! Ah! Oh, I'm in the water. Oh, I'm back again! 
Yes! Are you having fun? I don't know if he is. Oh, the best place. Oh god, the guy got sucked out. He's- Oh no! Urgh. Get me into the toilet! Get me into the toilet! I'll strap myself in! Toilets have seatbelts, right? Toilets should have seatbelts. Okay, there's a hole in the toilet. I could probably just crap out the window. That'll be fine. We don't need to poop in the toilet. Okay, hang on. I have a plan. I have a plan. Uh, grappling hook. Yeah, I'm gonna grapple hook myself to the plane. Super safe. Yes! I'm on the plane! Ah, I got killed by acid rain, though. Oh, oh, okay. I'm back here, out here again. I'm out here again. Yeah, this plane is now super crumbly. Uh, okay, I got thrown up into the air and I'm coming back down. Oh, ow, jeez, I just slapped my face on the plane. Now I'm in the water again. Now I'm in the sky again. What is even happening? Okay, we need to test something really awesome. Someone created an asteroid mod. This one actually penetrates whatever it hits, though. Watch this. Watch this. It's coming in. It's coming right down. Whoa, dude. Yes. Okay, before this thing sinks, I want to see what the damage was. It just put a giant hole in the side of the Titanic. That's crazy. Okay, let's hit this one. What ship is that one? I feel like you guys have told me in the comments, but I just forgot straight away. I was like, hey, that's not, that's a name I'm never going to remember. Thanks for telling me though. Man, that is some crazy destruction. This is exactly what would have happened if the Titanic never hit the iceberg, but was hit by an asteroid instead. Oh, this is really cool. I'm in some kind of press E to start map. Are you guys ready? I'm going to press E. Three, two, one. <laughs> that is so cool! What? Have a look how colorful and everything it is! That is awesome, man. And the neon sign there is, is there and everything. Everything is here. The shark's in the sky. We've got a helicopter up there. That is amazing. So I thought it would be fun to have my intro as like a map. And, you know, we take a look at it as a bit of a, uh, bit of a 1 million subscriber special. There's a platypus right there. I don't know if you guys actually noticed. There is a platypus in my intro. He is definitely there. There's actually quite a number of things hidden inside my intro. We've got like the sword here. And this map is going to be available on the Steam Workshop. So if you want to go ahead and play around in my intro world, <laughs> you can. I said to K Savvy, hey champ, you want to go ahead and try and make my intro? And he did an amazing job. This is really cool. We've got the VR koala there. I like to call him koala reality. That I never say that. I never say that. <laughs> Oh god, his head just came off! Oh, he's even red on the inside! What about slimes though? No, slimes are actually hollow. Who knew? Oh, we use the lightsaber. Let's use the lightsaber. Cut some slimes open. You guys are gonna go back and watch my intro now. I know that's gonna happen, so you can try and spot that platypus. Did you guys know there was a platypus there? Let me know in the comments if you knew he was there. I've just cut him up. I'm so brutal. So brutal. Oh man, this place is so colorful. So we've got the koala. Uh, it's not a koala. We have the kangaroo. This is the kangaroo that activates the button that turns on that thingy. Oh, hang on a second. Let's just change the weather. Yes. Yes, it's reflective. That looks so nice. So I'm told we should be able to turn this. Yeah, we can turn this thing off. Uh, I think I exploded it with the force though. Oops. We've got the big giant worm that comes out of the ground. The land worm thing. We've got the sofa. Very nice. Oh, sofa including removable cushions. What? Ugh, can I get the, the shark? Oh, I missed him. Come on, shark man. Missed. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, here he comes. <laughs> oh, God. He is red on the inside as well. I'm sorry, Bruce. I'm so sorry. I say, I say sorry as I'm shooting him in the eye socket. Hey, it's a blue slime, otherwise known as a rock slime, of course. The cool thing about this map is that it contains stuff from like the entire time that I've been on YouTube, you know? It's not just teardown, but we've got slimes, which I've been playing Slime Rancher since like forever. But the only thing it's missing from like the very beginning is like probably GTA. But we won't talk about the times when I made GTA. We have some hands. <laughs> Just some hands, okay? Now, I'm not gonna tell you guys what these hands are from, okay? They are a small pair of hands. Try and guess. And it's not just VR, okay? It's not just that. It's from something more specific than that. Oh, my shelves are falling down. Man, come on. Cheap shelves. What's through here? What do we got through here? Hey! Hey! We got Jump Bot! <laughs> That's so cool. I like how he's got an actual screen. And he's got the I love job mug. Oh, hey, dude. How's it going? 
Oh, his, his antenna thing or phone or whatever is attached to the side of his head. It fell off. That sucks. I'm going to take him outside somewhere safe. Come on, job bot. You're coming with me, dude. You are coming with me. Ah, oh, crap. I just realized there's a smashed up car here. What's with the smashed up car? Oh, dude, yes. Is this Poopy Tim? Yeah, we got Poopy Tim in here. Hey, dude, it's tiny Poopy Tim. Teeny, teeny poop. That's what we call him. Let's put him somewhere nice. Let's just put him over here next to the donut and uh, meat. I think that's a, I think that's a meat. Oh, it's a shame about his car. It's all stuffed up. This house is awesome. It's even got an emoji poo. Probably to represent the amount of videos that I've done that involve poo somehow. Hey! Hey! G'day champ, how's it going? <laughs> he just spoke to me. And I'm watching TV of myself. Isn't that nice? I'm just gonna shoot my own TV. Oh, I've got my teardown shirt on. I've got a black teardown shirt. Wow! I just surfed myself into the wall. Okay, I'm gonna get out of here. Come on. Come on, Finn. Hey, cool. You can be the one to push the button. I don't think it could be turned back on. That's all right. Yeah, I can surf my body into the worm. Ow. I destroyed all the stuff. I want to bring it back again. <laughs> Just whacked the kangaroo's jaw off. I need to hear myself say hello to me again. G'day, champ. How's it going? <laughs> G'day, champ. How's it going? <laughs> oh, yeah. Do the worm. Boy, that was my favorite cap. That is my favorite cap. I'm literally wearing it right now. Can we knock the helicopter out of the sky? Oh yeah, here it comes, here it comes. Nice. Physics gun and catch. <laughs> Good enough. Okay, Savvy said he hid something in the forest. Oh, hang on a sec. Hey, the rock is shaped like Australia. I live about probably about here somewhere, but I've actually lived pretty much all the way down here, all the way right down, even to Tasmania, which I actually destroyed. We've destroyed Tasmania. Sorry about that, chaps. Oh yeah, this is what I'm talking about. We've got the Finpire helicopter car. Nice. Time to mow this place down. That's it. Right over the trees. Right over, oh god, we've broken it already. We broke it. Just ow, ow, it's on me, it's on me. Just spin it round. Okay, it's all good. We fixed it. It's working again. It's kind of working again. Awesome! Look out, slimes! I'm coming through! <laughs> yeah! Chop up the worm! Oh, in the house. In the house! I'm gonna destroy my own bedroom. Oh, hey! You can move the button around. Dude, that is cool. Now, I saw something gold over this way. Let me just head through here for a minute. Where is this thing? Oh, there it is. Yes! Yes! It's the gold play button! Finpire! One million gold play button! So cool! Can we destroy this thing? Oh yeah, we can. That is awesome. I feel bad that I've already broken my gold play button, so I just restarted. Here we go. Yeah, ah, oh, I smash it up still. My gold play button should actually be arriving sometime this week. I'm super excited to get it. It's gonna be very cool. I'll go ahead and I'll put a photo of it over on Instagram so you guys can take a look. Oh, dude, that's cool. Can I surf it? Yeah, we can. We can. <laughs> this place is so big. I kind of want to make like a cave in the mountains. Wow, this is cool. Surfing on my own gold play button. Oh, but you know we're gonna break it. Ah, oh, smash. We've gotten gold everywhere. <laughs> Take that me. Hey, you can actually go through the hologram as well. That's amazing So like I said this map is available in the workshop If you've got tear down and you want to run around in this map You can go ahead and jump in the workshop and download it, but thanks for watching and thanks for 1 million subscribers I'll catch you guys next time